what is up guys a Finnish army talking here once again I haven't made a video for a while but we are back with another gameplay and this gameplay where I'm gonna be playing um, in the background Modern Warfare 3 Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 if you haven't already noticed and I'm, I'm pretty sure I did pretty freaking bad I mean I did kind of well I don't know what my KD was but uh, I, I, I did pretty freaking bad in this gameplay but this is a commentary. I've never done a commentary video ever. It's, it's weird to think, but I've never done a commentary on my channel. But uh, so I decided to make one today. You know? You know? Okay. But uh, today we're going to be talking about, you know, some cool stuff in space. You know? We, we got The Martian, the cool, freaking amazing movie. The book was amazing if you all don't know what it is it's about a manned mission to mars called aries uh those are the manned missions and uh they they're trying to you know colonize it do some scientific data stuff like that but basically there's a person or like matt damon this this like the the main character as mark watney mark watney is a person who got stuck on mars because of a dust storm Every like his crew, his like team thought he he died, so they had to abort the mission because of the dust storm. But they they let they had to leave Mark Watney, or it is Mark. They left him on Mars because they thought he was dead. But it actually happened not he like he wasn't dead, but everybody thought he was dead, you know. And he had to, you know, survive on Mars. He thought he had to survive for like, I don't know, like a hundred years? No, not a hundred years, forty. I already forgot what it was. But he had to survive on Mars. Uh, he had to like grow his own, you know, his his food on a planet where nothing grows. And uh, I'll go in and I'll link the, the, the trailer in the description below if you want to go and check that out or you can just search it up on YouTube or Google and uh, it's a pretty freaking good book and hoping the movie is gonna be good cuz I haven't seen it yet but I'm looking forward to seeing that and also if you haven't already like you know saw the news and stuff the NASA has actually found you know amazing like this is amazing to me They've found water, like traces of flowing liquid water on Mars, which is pretty freaking cool, you know, because, I mean, it is salty water, and uh, somehow there just is water there, you know, and uh, I'm going to, right now, I'm going to put an artist's impression of what ancient Mars may have looked like based on a geological data. Okay, so right here, as you can see, there's a lot of water and land. It looks pretty much like Earth, you know, but be because of, I don't know, just stuff happening in space, we Earth kind of just won, you know? The Earth became the planet of life, but I honestly think that Mars might actually have some sort of life. I'm not saying, like, intend intelligent life. I'm pretty sure there is none. But I would think that there is some microorganisms, you know, living in the water maybe, or underneath the surface, in the ice maybe, because there are uh, creatures, you know, animals and mammals that, you know, are able to be in ice and still living. Like, there's this fish, I don't know what the fish is called, I'm going to go and put it, put it on the screen right here, there it is, I don't know what it looks like, but, um... It, it's a fish that's able to be frozen in water, and then once once the water turns into liquid water, it comes back alive. So it basically just shuts down everything. It basically goes into like a very like it just shuts down kind of thing, you know. But it doesn't shut down. I don't know. <laughs> but once the water turns into liquid water it comes back alive it's really freaking weird i mean I, I wish i could do that shit but i can't i'm a human we're all human we, we can't do that shit you know we'd be like living all day and all night that type of shit but uh 
water on Mars, I would think that there's some sort of freaking, you know, cool shit happening there, you know. It is salty water, and also, what we could do with that water is, as if you haven't already seen, we have, we're trying to colonize Mars, we have done a lot of missions. If you haven't subscribed to the NASA YouTube channel, they're trying to, they're like doing so many like scientific data, scientific data, you know, analysis and stuff like that. They're trying to colonize Mars, hoping that's going to happen in my lifetime. God, that's going to be freaking cool. I'm going to go there if that, ha that happens. I'm going to go there and I'm gonna just going to die there. That's what's going to happen. Um, I ain't coming back. Even though the mission tells me to come back, I'm not coming back. I'm just going to stay up there. Don't give a shit if I die. I'm the first person to die on Mars, you know? That'd be pretty cool, right? No, okay. Um... Where the hell was I? I don't even know. What the frickin' crap? Yeah, they're trying to colonize Mars, so what they could do with the water is... It is salty water, but what they could do is, you know, take air and oxygen from the water, and then evaporate it, basically it comes humidity, and then that will leave the salt, and then they could like extract the humidity and then change it into water and then they have liquid water that's drinkable hopefully unless if it's some sort of like acidy salty water which we don't know yet we don't we haven't like analyzed the water yet but i mean it's not summer and that's what it does it only comes during the summer so yeah but i hope you guys enjoyed and Tell me if you, in the comment section below, tell me if you like this types of videos. If you do, make sure you smash that like button. If you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you didn't like it, make sure you dislike it, just so I know what you guys like and what you don't. Hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, peace from the Finnish Armor.